Hey there, it's Munchy Middlebert Mama, and yes, I am sitting in my car because, well, my kid's asleep, so I don't want to move her. So this is what you do when you're a mom. You have to eat your lunch in the car when your kid's asleep so you don't wake them. And uh, yes, in case you were wondering, this is a whole head of romaine lettuce because I love salads and uh, it's all mine. Woo! Anyway, that's not why I made this video to tell you how much I love salads and all that other jazz. Why I made this video is to talk to you about kiddos. Yes, through my years of observation of parents with kids, I would observe how they interacted with them and I would observe why were these parents happy and why do these parents look exhausted? Why do these parents seem to love to be around their children? And why do these parents, you know, they're always trying to ship them off to the next summer camp as fast as they can. What made the difference? So this is what I was thinking when I was observing. And I realized something. The difference was, is these parents had made their children a part of the mission. These parents had made their children the mission. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, these parents didn't make their life revolve around their children. Their children were not the center of the universe. Their children were a part of their life. So they took them wherever they went. They didn't see them as a burden. They told them no. They disciplined them. They just everything about it was their children were an important part of their world, but they also were helping them to be independent. They weren't trying to make their children dependent little Cleons that, you know, couldn't do a thing without the parent doing it for them. These parents had decided to take their kids along for the mission of life and their kids were not the center of attention is what I meant by they took their kids, and they were a part of the mission. Now, what do I mean by the parents who made their children the mission? By that, I mean they gave them everything they wanted, never told them no, never disciplined them, really made their children very dependent upon them as parents, even down to making their own sandwiches and things. And these children ended up being terrors in a lot of ways because they could not function without being the center of attention of their parents' world. And their parents ended up being very exhausted because their, their whole world revolved around their little kid or kids. And that gets exhausting when you're just focused solely on how to please a selfish little human being. Sorry, yes, your sweet little angel is a selfish little being. Okay, even my sweet little baby is a very selfish little baby. Um, all babies that age are. All little kids tend to be more that way. So, it's not just your kid. Anyway, <laughs> so, what I want to encourage you guys out there, you parents out there, is to make your children a part of the mission, not the mission in life. I think you will see a vast difference between the two, and you will end up loving having your children around more. You will end up loving your children more because they don't feel like they're just such an all-consuming burden that just sucks the life out of you. But if you have children like that, more often than not, sorry guys, it's probably your fault. You've designed, not designed, I shouldn't say that. You have shaped them to be that way. But it's not too late yet. You can remold them to be a part of the mission instead of the mission. So I hope this video made sense to you. And if it didn't, <laughs> feel free to comment and ask any questions. I would love to answer them for you. If you would like to see more videos by me, please subscribe on YouTube. And if you want to be notified of when I make videos, there's this little bell that you can click. And then every time I make a video, it will notify you. So if you'd love to do that, that's how you can do that. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in another video. Bye.